What's up ladies and gentlemen, Shark Friendly here with us play Un Uncharted Drake's Fortune Part 7. Here we are at the beginning of Chapter 7, and I'll go ahead and start it. And, oh, there's a grenade, uh, grenade launcher. Oh, there is a grenade launcher on here. And that's for blowing up, you know, multiple enemies. And also, uh, uh, you know, vehicles, multiple enemies. The gun is just, you know, really used for single, single targets. But because you have an unlimited amount of each, but the uh, the grenade just takes so much longer to reload that if you do miss with it, you know, you can sit there and use the, uh, you can sit there and use the machine gun to blow, blow people up. But really, you know, the grenade is the easiest and best way to go about destroying people, but like I said, if you do miss, um, you can always, you can always uh, just use the machine gun, but as you can see here, I'm really just using the, uh, really just using the grenade for right now, but you know, the machine gun does blow vehicles up very easily. The, the smaller vehicles, like the four-wheelers and the, the motorcycles. You're going to want to use the grenades for the, bit, the bigger trucks. Okay, see how much ammo I'm putting into the big trucks and they, they're not dying, but if you use, they're in, if you use, if you use the grenade launcher, you can kill the enemies a lot easier. Uh, sadly, I'm almost dead, so I'm probably going to end up dying. Ah, crap. There we go. Thankfully, the explosions won't won't kill me. Yeah, you know, if, if I hit, if I do hit a vehicle, uh, vehicle too close with a grenade, and, uh, thankfully the explosion won't kill me or, or damage me in any way. Here, have to look out for. I guess that was the only thing right now, but I'm pretty sure there's supposed to be another one. There we go. This is actually pretty easy, you know, it's just kind of tedious just because the way the controls, the controls work. The sensitivity for this is a little too high for my liking, but for the, you know, for the most part, it's, it's, easy, it's easy enough to sit in there and easily blow vehicles, the smaller vehicles up with the machine gun if you need to you really don't you know you don't you, you don't take any damage from the from vehicle parts hitting you or explosions your own explosions from the grenade launcher okay there we go that should have worked I think yeah goes with the territory. Let's get the hell out of here. Damn it. Come on. <laughs> Going somewhere? Hey, Eddie. Did you really think you could escape from what? Oh, no. I just giving the young lady the $10 tour. Shut <laughs> it. I bet you're working for them, too. What? 
You thought you could set me up and keep everything for yourself. Hmm? Damn it! This guy's crazy. Eddie, take it easy, buddy. <laughs> well, you're out of luck now. And out of room. Now. Give me that map. Hold on. All right. You got me. Fair and square. Hey, don't move. Relax, Eddie. Just get in the map like you asked. I said, hold on. I am. Well, hand it over. Well, now, you told me not to move. Looks like you're gonna have to come get it. Daddy, come on. Okay, and now that begins the, or now that's the beginning of chapter 8, so I'm going to go ahead and end it here. I thank you for watching. Next time we will run to the, the sunken city. Yeah, there will be treasures to find in chapter 8, so we will have to look out for that. So until then.